Well, good Sunday afternoon. It is the 29th-ish of May. Yeah. 30th of May? 29th. Anyway. Tomorrow's Memorial Day, how's that? Yeah! What are you doing today, Rick? Well, first beer of the day. It's fucking near six o'clock. Um, we're gonna go up here, we're gonna take the Super C, and we're gonna go over and do the garden, one part of the garden expansion. We're gonna be making this garden a whole hell of a lot bigger in the next year or two. But we're going to do it in phases so that way we can adjust into it as well because it's going to be a lot more work but with the fact that i'm not uh, a full-time eight eight to five or nine to five or anymore i got time to do that and i'll have more time in the spring to get plants and everything ready now that the greenhouse is rocking other than i gotta put a fucking door on it but it's been too hot in there any lately anyway so everything's rocking in there right now um i might do that door this week yet i don't fucking know whatever uh, I did check oil on it, Luke, just so you fucking know. You can see my uh, couple of drips there. She's full. Um, once it's done, we're going to go ahead and do a service on it again. Oil, um, check rear ends, all that stuff, because we got a few working hours on it now. I noticed I got a little bit of a leak on that side. You're getting a little bit of a residue down there. So we might have to get into resealing some stuff or what have you. But for today, we're going to go, we're going to put it to work for a minute. So let's jump on, see what happens, huh? This old two bottom, now that we got her dialed in, I think she'll turn the ground pretty good, so. <clears throat> oh yeah, oh, oh yeah. Oh, and beer, and camera, and um, starting sequence. Here, I'll, I'm gonna hold my beer with my foot. And uh, neutral, we'll uh, give her a little throttle. Give her a little choke. Give her a little on switch. Give her a little. Oh, come on. Choke in. She's fucking mint.
So I don't know if you could hear me when I was riding on the tractor. I need to move the the right hand wheel out about four inches because what's happening is I can't track the plow over far enough. That's why some of these rows stand up a little bit and they're a little bit proud. And you can see the the back side of the sod just a little bit there. It's not really gonna hurt anything, especially in a disking application. This one, eh, well, I guess we'll find out. So the next step is gonna be taking the uh, rototiller and fucking running over the top of it, see how we can break it up. We'll see how well the rototiller does in it. Oh, you know what? It's time we throw up a short video for once. So if you guys like what I'm doing, throw me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, ring the bell, get my notifications. Memberships are down there if you want one. I do appreciate it. The support on the channel really does help out. We were, uh, we're fixing to do a service on that in an upcoming video service check all the fluids again we're gonna adjust that tire um they were off when i got it so we're gonna move that one out about four inches and we're probably gonna move that one into match it because that one doesn't really i just want them to look right so we'll see you guys again next time